boost. And this morning, we're looking at a new health craze involving collagen. Celebrities and health enthusiasts are raving about its beauty benefits and adding it to some of our favorite dishes. Take a look. Collagen powder. It's the newest craze that some health advocates claim helps keep your body strong and your skin glowing. Celebrities like Jennifer Aniston swear by it. What is collagen? Collagen is one of the components of the deeper layers of our skin. It's what gives us our plumpness. As time goes on, you start to lose a little, especially once you hit 20, 25 years old. How do you use it? Sprinkle the fine white powder that's high in protein into your breakfast oatmeal or yogurt or even into your coffee. 30-year-old Suzanne Zappello decided to try collagen powder after learning about it in her social media feed. It was talking about being high in protein, being really good for your gut health, being great for your skin, and as a 30-year-old, those are all important things to me. Every morning for the past nine months, Suzanne puts a scoop in her coffee. And while she says she's noticed the most improvements in her stomach health, she says the benefits go beyond that. Even though I'm fairly young, I've noticed that over the course of several months that my skin has looked brighter. It's, you know, I've had small fine lines that have appeared to even out. This powder can cost anywhere from $10 to $50 a jar. But doctors stress that there are other, better ways to preserve your collagen. Eat well, get enough sleep, don't smoke, and make sure to use sunscreen every day. Would you recommend topical before? Or you would have someone ingest it? I absolutely would. Why? Because I'm, I'm putting it directly where I want it. That's how I think of it. If you take it in by mouth, you might get it where you want it, or it may just fill in in other areas in your body where you have collagen. As for Suzanne, she says she plans to keep using it for now. The days that I feel like, yeah, I really want a donut, I might have a donut because I know I'm doing all these other things to, to improve my health. For Good Morning America, Lindsay Davis, ABC News, New York. Thanks, Linz. And right now I'm joined by board-certified dermatologist Dr. Whitney Bowes. So you are in the office. Do you see a difference with people who use this? You know, it takes a lot for me to get really excited about something in this. I am getting pretty excited about it. Oh, that makes me happy it's to hear. It's still relatively new, but there are real studies, real evidence showing that by taking ingestible collagen, collagen you take by mouth, it can actually make a difference in your overall health and the health of the skin. And it's so easy. I mean, my patients just literally, let's take a scoop of the collagen powder, and then they just stir it into their coffee, they mix it into their yogurt, you know, and but the catch is... does it get is, or does it just... No, go? it stirs in actually very easily, and it's it's sort of flavorless, so it mixes into whatever you use it for, but it's it's new, right? So yep. buyer beware. You gotta look for brands that are reputable and have solid science behind All them. right, you know people love it hearing anything that can turn back the, the clock, but does it do anything else for your body? What else does it do? It, you know, it does. So when you think about collagen, it's not just about the skin. When you ingest collagen by mouth, you're body breaks it down into its building blocks right and then your body determines where it's going to send those building blocks and how it's going to use them so when you ingest collagen it could end up impacting your bones right your muscles your joints your ligaments and of course your skin I mean, but it sounds like all positives to me it, it's so far lots of positives you know it's still pretty early but if you're looking for more of a local effect like say you just have a problem area yes then I would say look for creams and serums that okay. contain an ingredient called peptides okay. because peptides when you rub them into the skin, they're going to boost collagen in that specific spot. Are these spot. ones that you don't use if you're getting sun, though? You wait till after the summer? No, these you can these. actually use all okay. summer long. They don't make you sun sensitive. Great so, question. So we have fruit here because we're wondering where does diet play into all of this? Well, I'm a firm believer that what you put in your body impacts your overall health and the health of your skin. And you need vitamin C to produce collagen. Your body actually requires vitamin okay. C to make collagen. So you want to look for deeply colored fruits and vegetables, things that are rich in vitamin C. Take home message, eat your fruits and veggies every day. All right, this is all great information. <laughs> Dr. Whitney Bowie, thank you so much.